What's going on? Episode one twenty eight nine nine one twenty nine. It's the Transfer of Experience Podcast. TEP. The boys are in here. The gang is in here. How's everybody doing? It's been a while. How are we feeling? The boys are back in town. Hey, that's their mind, that's yeah. a song that instantly came to my mind. I was about to sing it, but I wasn't. <laughs> I was gonna let you because I ain't got the voice. Bull got the voice. What? I Who was that by? I have no idea. I'm about to say it's some songs that's just so massive that you just know, but yeah. you don't know. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. one of them. For if I know sure. the words, some of the words too. I just know yeah. that part. Yeah. Back in time, that's one of my baseball songs. That's that's a very famous. That's issue. your walk up song. And it was just a warm up song. No. You know? <laughs> <laughs> um, but no, man, we're here today. Um, how's everybody feeling? Do we, do we got a temp? Trying to get a temperature of the room. How's everybody standing right now? Uh, I choose uh, to experience heaven on earth. That's been my mantra this week. So now you got to break that down for me. Oh man, All the way. I, I just I get uh, it, but I science. Wanna, yeah, because man, I don't, I don't, I just, I just want to be happy and enjoy my life. And I don't, I don't. It's stuff don't always happen, and you can always get caught up in it. But I choose not to. I want to be happy, mm-hmm. so I'm choosing happiness. Mm-hmm. That sound like that's about a woman, but it really ain't for a change. Well, I was thinking about life. I just yeah. if I say opposed to what, you're like yeah. you know, so, yeah. just being just weighed down by stuff and letting it get to you because stuff uh, gonna happen regardless. But it's yeah. how you react, react to, to the it. stuff because mm-hmm. stuff gonna happen regardless. And mm-hmm. I'm just choosing to be like, yeah, whatever. Mm-hmm. So because stuff been happening, but I just been like, you know, stuff gonna happen. That don't mean like. <laughs> You know, like you don't got to get caught up in it and worked up and just say, oh my gosh, I can't catch a break. Let it control you. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm just yeah. like, eh, yeah. It's, it's just something I got to deal with. Yeah. So, yeah. And since I've been having that mindset, some stuff kind of been working out for me. What's the mantra again? I choose to have heaven on earth. Yeah. I'm uh. not waiting, bro. Okay. I'm not. I'm going to enjoy this time here. Mm-hmm. I love that. Yeah, I love it. Because you too. can, like I say, stuff been happening though, but I just, <laughs> yeah. Whatever. Yeah. Like, do what I got to do to get through it and yeah. Yeah. keep yeah. on enjoying stuff, man. And mm-hmm. I don't know. I just been a little bit more locked in and intentional and stuff. And mm-hmm. I don't know. I just been, been lifting mm-hmm. heavier and I'm starting to see mm-hmm. results. My, my uh, wrist feeling good. Mm-hmm. That wrist. Uh, yeah. yeah. My ankle is, yeah. It's good enough for me to start back doing. You ain't running stairmaster. Nah, uh, I think I'm done with the running, man. I think it's just gonna be stairmaster, jump rope, and mm-hmm. rope machine for me. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That running stuff, it, it caused too much issues for me. <laughs> stuff start hurting. You've been running up for a long time in your life. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm chilling, bro. Yep. But I need to do some cardio to uh-huh. cardio to basis. Well, that's how I lose weight. Like I, oh yeah, you say you telling me that over the. Right, that's the only way I'm gonna trim up is if I do cardio. But I've been mm-hmm. doing a stairmaster. Yeah, ten minutes before yeah. I uh, get going. Work what out. number? Uh, I was at twelve, but now I do nine because nine the only way I'm gonna make it to to ten minutes. Okay, because okay. when I was doing twelve, I I was fighting for my life to make it to five. Okay, okay. <laughs> So yeah. that's funny because yeah. I'd be on five and be struggling to I'm make it to say, ten. I, I be, ain't gonna hold I'd be uh, lower than that. I'd yeah. be nine. I, I got a nine and I can get to ten. Mm-hmm. I was actually on the stairmaster when I was on the phone. Oh, I you. know. You like we <laughs> <laughs> He went through his whole like after yeah. work well, drove no. home, yeah. dressed, got no. dressed, worked out. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I know that. I've witnessed that. I've yeah. been on the phone for that every now and then. Yeah, but it don't change. Like the voice don't change, don't yeah, change. It's just that would be you can just hear out. stuff in the background and you know where he at. Ed be talking to these, y'all hear it. it, it. <laughs> 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 yeah. I mean, what you doing? He's like, oh, I'm just knocking out my conscience. What? <laughs> I, I, I need to be in my head for that. You know? That boy under that bench, get off me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't hear that one. <laughs> then, <Yeah>. he just <laughs> right, I I've, been, I've been really trying to. Uh-huh. But I feel like it's just. I don't know. It's always like it's not gonna happen this time because that's what I'm putting in the universe. But I feel like just when I'm starting to make my little progress, it's normally when I get hurt or something. But yeah, not yeah. this time. It's life of an athlete. But yeah, I'm starting to like see my little stuff kind of change. Gains, and, getting your gains. Yeah, man. I'm starting to wear back, back wearing my little. Sw- I, yesterday I had on a sweatband, a t-shirt, a sweatshirt vest, which is a sweatshirt with the sleeves ripped off. Okay. And a hoodie on top of that. Okay. Yesterday you trying to get to it? Like that. You know, it kind of just accidentally happened. I just like saw that, 
Like, because the sweatshirt is just, mm-hmm. like I say, it's a sweatshirt without sleeves. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I guess you call that a sweat vest. Is that what you had on when you came to my house? Saturday? I don't think so. Okay. My bad. Okay. I, 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 I probably wouldn't be wearing it around town. No, I didn't have that. Okay, okay. 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 No, it's literally just imagine a sweatshirt, <laughs> but you cut the sleeves. Yeah. Up, but then you cut the side. Like we was doing t shirts. Yeah, but we were doing uh, the t yeah, 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 yeah. with a sweatshirt. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. I don't know how that happened. But. <laughs> But yeah, man, I, yeah. I've been feeling good though, man. I that's just good, been on that trying that, to that's good. get uh get built up though, and it's going well. And yeah, man, <laughs> does the uh does the sweatband work? As far as it make you sweat, okay. In my mind, I'm like, I don't want to get a sweatband if my mid drift ain't gonna ain't no, gonna drop down. Don't. Yeah, well, I think it worked. I think it worked. Okay. You for sure be sweating. Like yeah. when you take it off, it's like dripping. drenched, mm. yeah. like dripping. Mm. Like gotta sanitize the, it every time after you. What's the purpose of it? A sweatband. Just make, just make you sweat. sweat. You need. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's why I was. That's why I was asking because I was like in my mind, I know it make you sweat, but do it like because I know you gotta wear it around. Yeah, mm-hmm. but I don't be wearing it outside of like. Oh yeah, no, nah, I just wear it. To it ain't a waist trainer. Yeah, uh, so I just. <laughs> I just wear that to give me a little extra sweat in my mid drift. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's about right. Tighten it up. Yeah, yeah so mm-hmm. I, I've been doing that, man. It's, it's been good. You know, the holidays. Uh, mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I don't know the last time we recorded it, man. Uh, it's probably been some weeks. Yeah, I was about to say. Yeah, yeah it's, been, it's been some holidays. Few weeks. Was, was pretty cool, man. Mm-hmm. Uh, I bought you some ham, but I didn't see you in time, and I didn't freeze it. But I, I bought ham back to Dallas for you. Ah. Uh. But you need yeah, it. yeah, pause. But I didn't freeze it. So that's all right. That's all right. That's I, all right. I, it was half the battle. I did remember though. It's all know. right. It's good. Yeah, yeah. I but get it. My ham came out good this year, man. I uh, kind of tweaked. I, at this point, I know the ingredients because I to make the glaze and like the first time I made like a small batch, I kind of used the recipe. But then the next one, I was like, "Well, these all the ingredients, but let me." Mm-hmm. Yeah, mix yeah, and match. Yeah, so yeah. Now I'm at that point where now I just know the yeah. ingredients and ain't it's no measure. Yeah, let yeah. me get my eat off. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But it came out well because I had like way more of it, and I like you couldn't accuse that thing of being dry by any means. Mm. I I lathered that thing up. Mm. Pause, maybe I don't know, but uh, it came out good. Then uh, my brother, we got a smoked turkey from somewhere. It was good though. It was mm. like. It was it was well seasoned. It had a nice little smoke taste, but mm-hmm. I was seeing this recipe for this lady who like just baked the turkey, but she like really freaked that mug. So I want to try that next year. Mm-hmm. But you know you can't like the turkey though. I'm gonna have to like get a turkey and just make that beforehand yes. to practice. Yes, because I don't want to be. I don't want my first time with it to be. Yeah, you're you coming out on, on the on, on yeah. Thanksgiving yeah. and yeah. something go wrong. And you gotta do a like, trial run. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, I'm going to get some turkey before yeah. Uh, yeah. Thanksgiving next year because I'm going to have to practice. Yeah, yeah. Can you buy turkeys year round? Yeah. yeah. They, they be just there. be at the store all the yeah, yeah, they be there. Just, they it just don't be in bulk like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just be eating turkey year yeah, round. Yeah, yeah. Turkey legs. and I know legs and yeah. wings. No, whole turkeys. Did you turkey? know that's the trend now? The the Instagram chefs that was frying turkey wings? Yeah, they said that's what, you, that's what you can do now instead of doing the whole turkey. Yeah, that was just frying turkey wings. But they wouldn't be like when you think of fried, it ain't like it ain't like chicken. crispy. It's and, like yeah. it ain't got like no. It's like if you was just to fry something without putting batter on it, yeah. they don't yeah. batter it. Yeah, they don't yeah. batter it. Yeah. 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 I saw that today. Yeah, they don't batter it because that boy Paul was like, "Oh, I got an idea. How about if we just like do the turkey wings and we do each one in a different season?" I was like, "Boy, if you just want wings, just say that." And one, we're not doing that on Thanksgiving. You do that on your own time. Yeah, that's another. <laughs> you have yeah. a wing party. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't, don't bring that on. Don't, my, don't, don't bring that to Thanksgiving, yeah. bro. Yeah, don't put that on my. It's like, it's like I, you do that on your own time, bro. I was like, and you know, because like, yeah, you can do something like lemon pepper. But I was like, no, bro, if you just want chicken wings, just say that. And the answer is no, not for Thanksgiving, bro. I'm sorry, Paul. Now Christmas, I don't have no structure for Christmas. We don't abide by traditional Christmas standards. I don't even know what traditional Christmas standards is. Halloween, honestly. I mean uh, Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving food. Yeah. Again. Except okay. for things, except for a turkey, some people do, do roast. roast. Yeah, yeah. everything else is the same. Yeah, yeah, we don't. We abandoned that a long time ago. Yeah, 
Y'all did a Mexican one last year. We be doing random yeah. stuff. Sometimes yeah. it's gumbo. Sometimes we just fry seafood. See, I'm gonna say, I don't. I don't think I've ever done like the traditional Christmas thing. I, it's always been like gumbo or. I about to say. I about to say my family the traditional thing isn't even that. We do like that's when we do like the real nasty country cooking. <laughs> Pig, uh, pig, pig feed, feed and chitlins. chitlins. That's what we'll do for hog the, mall. Yeah, yeah. yeah we, that's when we'll do that kind of stuff. Like, yeah. uh, you know, it'd be like macaroni stuff in the house, but the main, yeah. mm-hmm. the, the star of the show, basically the house thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah but yeah, 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 yeah. You right, you right. It, hey, it gonna be a pot outside on the propane. Yeah. yeah, yeah. We do something on the propane. Yeah, yeah that's what we do. So, but no, but no, man. Uh, my Thanksgiving was good. The holidays were great. Um, I had got off. It's funny, man. I said this over the weekend. I think I told y'all. But, like, my job, we literally did. We literally, we literally worked half a day on Wednesday mm-hmm. just to get a potluck off. Yeah. Like, wasn't nobody really working. Yeah. It was just for the potluck. Yeah. I, I did the wings again. Y'all uh, went home after the potluck? Uh, Yeah. We went, we, we went home. Oh, yeah. Yeah. They should just did that on Tuesday. Well, yep. I said, I said, man, we could have left, bro. I said, I could, I could be gone because yeah. I got to drive. You know what I yeah. mean? I got to drive. Like, bro, I'd much rather leave at 7 than 2. You know yeah. what I mean? Mm-hmm. And I, you know me, I was moving with a purpose, had everything packed up, you know yeah. what I mean? After the potluck, came home, got that stuff, went home. But it was good, and um, I made, I did a turkey as well. My turkeys be good, man. I wish I could have gave y'all some. Because mm-hmm. I use, like, unconventional seasoning. Like, yeah. I, be blow, <laughs> I be blowing my mama out the water, bro. She don't even, cook, she didn't even cook a turkey this year. Ooh. You know? She just let you have it. It's huh? three years running, baby. Three years, Beecher. Three years. You yeah, hear him talking that. Finally, she's just like, you should do the turkey. I'm like, all right. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Because <laughs> that threw me off. My mom was like, oh, yeah, your ham in the refrigerator. Yeah. Right now. You know what I'm like, what? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dang. Okay. 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 Yeah. It's like, yeah, don't, like, don't forget your job. Yeah. I was yeah. like, dang, yeah. that's like really my role. Yeah. That, hey, that's the thing about Thanksgiving. That's the unspoken rule. Once you cook that thing yeah. once, yep. that's as yours. As long as it turn out, yep. dude, it's yours. That's yours. That's yours. Now, that's how you know you did a good job. Though. They be like, yeah. you doing that turkey? You doing mm-hmm. that ham again? But yeah, I'm going to bust them over the head with uh, the turkey. I got a plan, man. Yeah. Man, uh, it was good. Uh, you know, I did all this stuff. I also made... Of broccoli and rice uh, casserole, mm-hmm. and then and this was so the turkey we did at the house. That casserole I bought to grandma house with everybody else, so mm-hmm. it, it had to stand up with everybody else yeah. size though. Yeah. You know what I yeah. mean? But it wasn't a lot left. It was not a lot left. Yeah, yeah. So, I remember the the, yeah. the the separate Thanksgiving meals. Mm-hmm. I missed it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, and you know, this was our first uh, Thanksgiving without the matriarch. You know, yeah. without my grandmother. So. It was a bigger emphasis on like everybody come to Grandma House because yeah. you know we doing it in memory of her. So that was nice. It was just yeah. a typical Thanksgiving, and I remember in there uh, in the house we was just talking, and I was just like, "Yeah, we're getting older now. Like now we got to bring something instead yeah. of just our appetite." You know yeah. what I mean? That my cousin said, "Like yeah, everybody got to start cooking now." You yeah. know what I mean? Have something going, but it was nice. Um, I got to relax. I don't know about y'all, but the Thanksgiving days they felt like full days. To me, like mm-hmm. I didn't feel like a day went by too quick or too mm-hmm. slow. Yeah, all my like th- Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, something was like some. But I be saying my time back home moves so slow. I'm about to say it might be that, but it moves so slow to me. Yeah. Like ten be feeling like one thirty in the morning to me. I be mm-hmm. like exhausted come ten. Mm-hmm. Like yeah. if the days be dragging, which yeah. is good because you don't be out there much, so you definitely don't feel like yeah. dang the time just went by. Like nah, I felt every hour. I remember yeah. when it was eleven, <laughs> twelve, <laughs> one, two. Like yeah. yeah, yeah. But no, it was good. Um, did the normal things. Went and saw uh, all my people. We had a good time, and it was a good time to just like relax and just like. Cause I had like emails from work that was coming in, yeah. But I just like turned that stuff off, you know. Yeah, you got but to. You got to, man. I had to like uh, detach and disconnect. I got a good. I was able to disconnect pretty pretty well. Yeah. And plus, out there, you just get like Ed said, it drag. But then you, it's funny because it drag, but you get caught up in stuff because mm-hmm. out there it's like, hey, bring this to your cousin house, bring this to yeah. your uncle. Then at your uncle, he's like, man, go to the store, give me some beer. Yeah, you do that, then you just that's how you maneuver the yeah. day. Like, mm-hmm. I don't really get that out here. Out here is like, I'm at work, yeah, I'm at home, or we doing something. Yeah, that's really like the only three sections of moving around. I do out yeah. there is be a whole different thing, but it was great. I enjoyed it. Uh, turkey came out good. Uh, shout out to Carla. I used her oven. <laughs> Cause mama had mama used all the ovens downstairs, so I had to go upstairs. Yeah, and do it. Uh, but everything was good though. I I enjoyed my holiday, man. Uh, 
What about you? Bro? Was it good? It was good, man. I saw uh, the pictures, man. I looked nice. Oh, thank you, man. Thank you. You think uh, Emery and your uh, niece, nephew, niece. look alike? Yes. Oh, somebody yeah. said that to me. I was like, I don't know. They yeah, they I, was, I saw that picture. And I was like, I don't know. That's hard for me to tell with babies though when they baby babies mm-hmm. if they look alike. Well, she she looked more like him whenever she was like first born. Like uh, they look just alike, same hair, same cheeks, same eyes. Like they look just alike. Uh-huh. But now she's like filling out more, so she's looking more like her dad mm. uh, than anything. But yeah, they just they both like skin with good hair. Mm. Like that's yeah. that's really all it is. But um, but yeah, man, we was uh we went to Austin. We didn't we didn't go home. Yeah. So um, we was at my partner's parents house okay and uh for thanksgiving we ended up going to her aunt's house so like <laughs> do they do the same tradition i was about food? to say it's they do the I was same about to that too. yeah they do the they do the same traditional stuff like turkey they do stuff in um i think somebody did some greens yeah uh, somebody did like some uh, green bean casserole. That's where I like cut it off. I'm I not doing do that. Yeah, I'm, I'm not about to do that. I love it. Uh, I don't like it at you all. You like green bean casserole? My mama make it. Good. I don't think yeah. I've had black people being green bean casserole. I don't think I ever had black people. It's only been white people and I, Hispanic I, people. I think I said, a lot of Hispanic people that. do that though. I wish like, I knew that. I would have bought y'all some. Yeah, but it's. I mean, it's it's pretty much the same. Like. She her side of the family is like really Hispanic, but mm-hmm. a lot of their family like have like black like her aunts have black husbands. Mm-hmm. So <laughs> so is 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 not too different, you know what I'm saying? It's um, a mixed household. Is no for real. Like for I, I real, like for that. real. It just be their interpretation might be a little different. Or not even that. Not even that. Oh, okay. So it was the same. Yeah, it was pretty much the same. Flavors be the same. Yeah, like some. Like yeah, it was. It wasn't bad. Like you know, like I say, it had pretty much the same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. (laughs) Yeah. Um, (laughs) but yeah, man. So it was. It was cool. Uh, it was different. We didn't eat till like five o'clock. That's why, like, when you was asking, I was like, yeah, nah, nah. We still. It was like twelve o'clock. It was like, is anybody eating yet? No. We hadn't even left the house. Like I was the only one dressed, so yeah, it was one of them situations. Yeah, yeah. Um, of course, I didn't cook nothing or bring anything, but uh, Bree tried to. I ain't gonna say she tried to, but she made some like candied yams. But she don't listen to me, and I was like, "This is something that you need to do beforehand, so that you can like have it together whenever you cook oh. it. Whenever we get there, so it was good. Like people liked it, but it went candied. No, ha! And well, yams are pretty sweet. Now. Well, I was about to say it, it's like they were kind of sweet. Like she used all of the stuff, but you gotta like make it that first time, taste it. Yeah, oh, yeah. that was like the okay. first time ever making candy yams. Yes. Oh no, that ain't the day experience. Exactly, you exactly. Just you yeah. really, just literally, no yeah. And I was like, that's and that's I what tried I told it like her. a week before. Yeah, yeah and yeah. that's literally what I told. Her. I was like, you need to like try this because she like randomly was like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna make some like yams, and I was like. You and this was like on Wednesday on the way there, and I was like, "Nah, you need to like do that last week, week and yeah, then yeah. taste it, see how it's a, you know, yeah, see how it see tastes, that. and see then you, yeah, 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 because she she the type of person like she don't like to follow a recipe like <laughs> from the jump, yeah, like she'll see what's on the recipe list, I'm like I'm not doing it, and she'll like get all the ingredients, but then she won't like follow it. She'll uh, just be like, oh yeah, let me like throw this in here and let me throw this in there, and then after it's done, she will be like. Uh, I probably should have. Yes, yeah. you should have. That's why it's a recipe. Yeah, yeah, that's why. Like that's why recipes are. I'm common. pretty. I'm pretty by the book the first time. Yeah. Then, like once I build up my confidence and I can like okay, let me. Yeah. yeah. And then you start yeah, freestyling. Yeah. Exactly. The first time exactly. I do, I fall by the book the first time. Yeah. Or then you get the idea. And you're like, oh, okay, so basically I just need to do this. And this yeah. And this, then yeah. I can season however I want. Yeah. Exactly. Yes. Exactly. Yeah. So uh, she did that. Like I said, people liked it. Um, and the food was pretty good. Like like I say, somebody made broccoli rice and cheese. A roll too. I'm not that type of guy. I don't like that either. Uh, but everything else was was pretty good, man. And um, it felt good being, you know, being out there. Emery was out there with some kids and stuff. You know, all of her cousins got kids, so mm-hmm. that are around his age. So it was like nice to see him like 
running around and like and, having and fun with kids yeah kind of him and one of them is like beefed out beefed out <laughs> like i'm talking about it's on site every yeah. time they see Childhood each other beef. that's part of it too yeah that's like, part of it too i don't, I don't say miss I don't, that dude i'll about to say i don't say nothing i just look at him he, and he he, he gotta go through that I was about to say, and yeah. he hold his own it ain't like he yeah. just be like he crying he just he be throwing them all <laughs> the, the funny thing be that that be that they be a girl be like, man we used to fight all the time then they be best friends best when friend. they get about teenagers yeah, yeah. exactly yeah exactly and that's that that exactly history. what it's gonna be that's that history like, yeah. man, used to, man i used to be we used to fight here all the time exactly every day bro we saw each other we yeah. had to on fight. site yeah I like and, that. and i'm talking about it's on site like they see each other they walk it's out the boy it's up yeah they see each other. It's a wrap. They, they just run. instantly get to it. Just get straight to it. No, don't do no talking. Just go with your mood. <laughs> 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 but the funny thing is, like, they'll fight and then they'll like kind of follow each other around. Then they'll fight again. Yeah. And then one of them will start crying and then they'll fight again. They really cool. Yeah. They really cool. They really cool. Like, that's just part of their problem. Yeah, 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 like, yeah, yeah. But it's like, and uh, the the cousin he like probably like a few months older than Emery is. Like six months, maybe. So they the same age. Okay. So yeah, I was just like, yeah, that's just, that's funny, bro. Like, just how you just have it on your mind at that age. Yeah. But um, but yeah, man, it was it was pretty cool, man. This long drive. Uh-huh. It was. It was uh, over three, bro. Yes. How about say? Was it? On the way there, it was. We got there in like five hours. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So you went to orange. At that exactly. point, thirty exactly. more minutes would have got you there. Yeah. Um, and then on the way back, it was six. Yeah, I just take thirty five. Yes, it just be that backed up during the holiday season. Yeah, because yeah. I've never been to Austin during the holidays. Yeah. Yeah. Like only one way to get there. Yeah, but I was about to say, yeah, but that's, nothing, huh? that's what you got to do. Yeah, and so, no and you know, we up north. So oh, yeah, seventy five so was packed up. Oh yeah, it took an hour for us to get to downtown. Nope. We, we got past downtown. We went through, <clears throat> we just took 35 all the yeah. way there. Once you get on, once 35 East and 35 West merge, and now you on 35, yeah. that's when traffic started again yeah. because now you about to get into Waco, and yeah. Waco mm-hmm. is always traffic. Yeah, yeah. they can um, fix that. They have to. Are, um, they, are they working on that? No. Uh, they just like, well. No, because one, I feel like they're not going to work on it because, you know, it's a bridge that go over water and then yeah. the stadium is over here. So yeah. if you start working on that, yeah. there's never not going to yeah. be traffic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. Um, yeah. They're going to have to bite that bullet at some point. At yeah. some point, maybe. Or they might just like do what everybody else do and build a toll on the other side. By the same road construction take a while unless they're just going to dedicate a crap ton of manpower to get it done. Like around football season, yeah. I'm about to say but normally that crap take years, not just yeah, nah, it's it's not no months. months yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's why I said the, the fact that it like go through like the middle of Waco, they probably just do that's like the thing a, about um, it, yeah. Yeah, they probably just do a um Toll. a tollway. And that's I, what everybody's doing at yeah. this point. I only know. Waco from 35 like I have no other vantage point of what Waco looked like I only yeah. know it based like Dang. off I'm of only the, the stadium been, yeah I've yeah. only ever been off of 35 like I didn't got food but it was right there off of 35 yeah. like I have no other I oh. can't name no other area of it, like uh, Waco like I don't know if that's actually through the middle of Waco the yeah. eastern part mm-hmm. the western what's the other highway 295 for what to go like to what? Houston from Austin uh, it's 290 290 but there's another highway. Like I came into Waco a different way, but oh but, yeah, well yeah, yeah, I don't know. But anyway, I yeah. was about to say there's only one way to get there. to Austin. Uh, yeah, yeah, so yeah, that's and that's why it took no so other long. Way. There's no other way to go. Yeah, that's why it took so long. It's just when did y'all leave? We left Wednesday, probably around one thirty. Oh, mm-hmm. yep, that'll do it. Yeah, and you know I worked half a day. I had a couple meetings in the hey, morning. No cap, you probably was in the same traffic mm-hmm. I was in. Probably. Bro. You was definitely in the same because it, it took me a little while. Yeah. Like after I got through Dallas, it was good. Yeah, but getting through Dallas, Wednesday, that's the thing. You, it was yeah. It you got to get through Dallas it was to bad. get to the other that's side. That's the hardest part. Yeah, of the whole trip, you have to get through Dallas. Of the whole trip, my bad. I'm talking away from them. Yep. Um, but yeah, that's that's like the hardest part of the whole thing was to get from where we live to like downtown to hit that loop so that we can go out and uh head towards Waco. We got to Waco, literally stopped. Like traffic was yeah. like stopped It'd at a standstill. Like that, and I was like, okay, cool. Then Emery woke up. He wanted to get out of there, and I wasn't even mad at him because I was like, we've been here 
in the car for like three hours at this point. And we, yeah. we, I didn't even see the stadium at that point. Oh, damn. oh, yeah. And so we hadn't eaten since earlier. So I was just like, bro, like, let me just get through this traffic and then I'll stop. Mm-hmm. Cause once we get through the traffic, then I don't, I don't mind like hopping off, grabbing something and then hopping back on and mm-hmm. dipping. Mm-hmm. Um, so we finally got through there. And then once we got into Austin, of course, more traffic course. because it's Austin yeah. mm-hmm. and they actually working on them uh, highways. So it's just that much worse. But the only thing, the good thing about Austin is I know Austin now. So like, I know when to get off, where to go, you know, how to get around. So yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. once we got into Austin, I was just like, all right, let me exit and just so hit my little back roads yeah. and get there. So, yeah. um, and then on the way back, it was just no way to avoid it. We left on a Saturday too. Uh, tried to be smart. Wait, what time? We left early. We left around ten thirty. No, no, ten thirty eleven. Yeah, yeah no. Nah, we, I, if I'm by myself, I'm leaving at six, seven, like eight at the latest. But I'm not, so yeah. we didn't. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, we got out of there. Because you, 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 you caught the oh, let's not get caught on the Sunday, yeah. so let's leave Saturday. Yeah, traffic. Yeah. Like because people. Other people had that idea. That's what exactly. I was, and that's what I was telling Bree. She was like, "No, nah, I don't think." And I was telling her parents that I was like, "Nah, we not, we ain't smart unless like, you leave earlier because ten yeah. is like a, that's what time regular people wake up and get exactly. on the road." Exactly, and they're like, "Oh no, I think you're gonna be good." I was like, no. "We not the only ones that's thinking about the traffic yeah. that's gonna happen tomorrow." I was like, "Traffic gonna happen tomorrow, but today is gonna be like the later part of the day." Mm-hmm. So we live around like I want to say we got on the highway at eleven thirty. Oh, nah. We didn't get home until six. Yeah, that makes sense. Like we pulled up at five fifty nine. Uh, I, I didn't. I didn't hit any traffic. I, w- I was boots on the ground going to Orange at eight. I told you it took me that way that I never been before. Through Tyler, Taylor, Tyler, Jacksonville, Alto. I went through Alto, mm-hmm. all oh. these towns. You went where, through uh, where, where you end up getting on um, Jasper and Kirbyville, maybe 69. Yeah, 69. Yeah, 69 96 yeah. to 69. Yeah, uh-uh. mm-hmm. I, I didn't like, like it. I like that one. I didn't like it because the the speed limit varied too much for me. Mm-hmm. Like, I couldn't relax. Going mm-hmm. I couldn't relax because it was like, oh, shoot, I'm supposed to be going 35. Okay, now I can go 55. Now I can go 60, 75. Mm-hmm. Okay, now it's back to 55. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I just, Where did you experience that? Because that's not my experience. Man, I'm gonna have to show you my path because I because okay. I know because I was when it took me that way. I was kind of confused, but I was like, I'm gonna trust the GPS because I got off of. I don't even think I made it to where 45 become 45. I took like. You got back like, on 45. Going no, on? I'm just saying uh, like I took like I never got I was I never took 45. Yeah, like, I took like, like yeah, 180 back three. Way, back no, way. you did. You took 175. Maybe to go through Kaufman and then you got on 96 or well, 287, 275. Then that took you. I know that way, by the yeah. way. That's yeah. why I'm saying, like, because it's 75 all through there. Nah, nah, no, no, once you, I'm not I'm talking about, say, about, once you get I'm to not the, talking about when you get to the small towns, but on that 175, that's yeah. 75. Yeah, at one point I was yeah. going 75, but yeah. then it like I started going once small you get off towns, in and get yeah. off up into that. Yeah, thing. well, once you get to Jacksonville, you slow down. Yeah, but it's 75, then it is 55. Yeah, then you get up in there. Yeah, yeah. when you get when you get close to a town, it'll go down to 55. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah. it was going down, but it was mm-hmm. it was still like I said, it was. Smooth, and, and you can speed through the little the little fours in Jasper. Oh yeah, when that's it's what just I two hit. lanes, and that's it ain't what I just hit trees. ninety. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you yeah, gotta you yeah. gotta kind of be careful on that thing though, because I, like I think the, the last see, time we went, me and Ed was on the phone, and I seen a cop. I was like, okay, yeah, let me <laughs> let me holler at you later, bro. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah, I, that's I, I when. Uh, oh, go ahead, my bad. But yeah, I didn't I didn't really see too many on the way. And then I came back Saturday, but I was boots on the ground at five thirty. Yeah. I was on the road at five. Yeah. Oh my! So yeah, was, nah, you ain't playing. He was, with yeah, it. It was moving smooth. with a purpose. I was gonna say that boy probably got home in less than five. Yeah, I, I was. I was back, but I left at five thirty. I was back by maybe eleven something. Maybe. Maybe eleven. Yep. I was about to say, maybe. You, I was about to say you said eight. I, I mean, nah, uh, yeah. I was, I was like, damn. Nah, you was on it. I left, yeah. but you went through Houston on the way back. I uh I went to, yeah, yeah, 105. Yeah, I used to okay. go 105 on the way back. Like through Sour Lake and all yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, but it was I, smooth. Yeah. I think I left Sunday. Uh, I left Sunday around 10. Yeah. Um, but I don't know. My drive be a little bit more leisurely. Yeah. I don't know why. Cause I, I was about to say, uh, you, you, you ain't never just on in a hurry to get back. I'm not back. like, yeah. friend, like, I don't know. Get my head. I'm like, what am I getting back to? But, yeah. you know, that but, but Sunday was a different. Uh, yeah. Cause I started uh, that second job, 
So I now work a second job overnight, mm-hmm. uh, eight to two, and Sunday was my first day. Uh, so I left at like uh, like ten. So I got back around what like two, three, yeah. you know, three thirty, and they gave me a time to just chill. Yeah. Um, but at eight o'clock, I, I went to my second job, and it was cool. Bro. It was just like the little distribution center for the post office, bro. Yeah. All you doing like there's like three different like. Stations, yeah. The main station is where you they got like working mail, yeah. I don't know if I, if I should say this because they did a whole background check, but anyway, yeah. <laughs> anyway, you do like this little working mail, it's like a side B, side A, and it's like a warehouse, right? Excuse me, and it's like cutting to do two sex, two sides, B side, A side. B side is kind of like everywhere else in the country, yeah. A side is like mostly Texas South, yeah. you know what I mean? So you have these. Uh, these pallets of mail come right off the truck. Now, this is what we call working mail. So you'll take that, put it on a conveyor belt, you go up, it scans a barcode, and then it'll just funnel that into the right section. Yeah. So when it comes down that little section, another conveyor belt, you just stack it in like a little bin, mm-hmm. you scan it, and then you send it off, and then they'll load that up into the outgoing yeah. mail. So that's working mail. Direct mail goes straight to where it's supposed to go. Yeah. So that's what I did yesterday, uh, two days ago. Yeah. But my first day I went there, and it's just just a working man's place. Like yeah. it ain't like no, it ain't a lot of thought to the work. It just put the stuff on there. Yeah. Look at the like the numbers. It's sorted by the zip codes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But they don't give you the whole zip code. Give you like the first three numbers. So I'm getting real. You know I'm a geography person. Yeah. So I kind of like that. Yeah. Three eight two. Three three one yeah. Miami. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. I see seven six. That's Houston. Yeah. I see seven five. San yeah. Antonio. You know. Yeah. Eight five. Blah blah blah. That's Phoenix. You know yeah. what I mean? And you just put it where it's supposed to go. That's what I was doing the first two days. I was just sort the mail. And it's kind of the job. Like that's 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 like the man's job. Yeah. It's like heavier. Yeah. These are like crates of mail. Yeah. They're not like huge. But I was about like, to say, but paper heavy. Paper. So they got a yeah. little weight to them. They got a little weight yeah. to them. And it's like a little workout though. Yeah. Like, like you yeah, know, them shoulders are sore. Hey, huh? hey, the back, guy, yeah. I, you know, I was oblique. So yeah, you know what I'm saying. Hey, you do that, the Roman twist. I like that's what's a twist right there. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but How I feel getting off at two o'clock in the morning. No, you know what I'm saying. Just, yeah, you just no. I'm about to say no. What's that? Six hours to be empty. Uh, huh? Empty, yeah. bro. I was just yeah. You know what I'm saying, but it's cool. Um, a lot of like. Foreign people in there, you know what I'm yeah. saying? And you meet people. You that's for the place everybody got a story. Yeah. I mean, I started out. <laughs> yeah. I started out, you know, in, in tech. Yeah. Then I caught a case. You know? Oh, <laughs> and I was like, hey, what case? <laughs> <laughs> what case, man? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He like, I was just scamming. I was, Oh, oh okay. I don't think you should be. Yeah, here, I was about to say they let you work here. They let you work here. Yeah. People it. mail, but you don't see nobody. Like it's like a crate of mail, but then it's like a cardboard box around it. Yeah, and that's where all the bar barcodes are. At. Yeah, and that's what I was doing Sunday. So I worked Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday mm-hmm. night. So Sunday was cool that I just did that, but Monday I had to start. You know, I was working two jobs. Yeah. I went to my day job. Yeah, and then that's I was, when you start feeling it. I didn't start feeling it to Tuesday because that was the complete cycle. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So Monday. I went to work. It was cool. Uh, it was the day job. So I get off at 5, but the other job started at 8. Mm-hmm. So it really ain't no... You can nap. Yeah. But it's like, you can't deep sleep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's like really just one of those just like this. Like, mm-hmm. all right, you really not yeah. sleep, but you just, okay, you know, yeah. recharge. See, that's the type of naps that irritate me when I wake up. <laughs> I'll be mad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'll yeah. be mad and more time than when I went to sleep. No, Sunday, not Sunday, Monday when I got off. I like lay down at like five fifteen because I gotta get home, right? Yeah. And then I woke up at like, and you know it's Monday night like football on, so uh, I'm here in the game, whatever. I woke up at like six thirty, six forty five, and I was just like, well, just stay up now, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Just stay up now. Uh, the other, uh, Tuesday, I didn't even go to sleep. I was just like, nah, I'm not yeah. Doing that. Like, I'm not even gonna do my body like yeah. that, you know. Uh, but the last day I worked, which was Tuesday, well Wednesday morning, yeah. technically. Um, then that's today, huh? No, that was yesterday. Yesterday, yeah, that was yesterday. Yeah, anyway, you got my bad. Off my bad. I got obvious. Yeah. See, yeah. time, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yep. It, it gets you know sk- yeah. skewed. But I got off, and I was just like, no, I got off the morning job, and I was just like, I ain't going to sleep. I like, went to work, and this th- that day was cool because I got to do like what they call uh, expedite. Mm-hmm. So I got the scanner. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I ain't just 
doing manual labor. Yeah. At, they call it the sort. And yeah. the sort is when you just sort and stuff. Yeah. And that's the real manual labor. The expeditors, it's a little bit more thought to it. Yeah. That's when the truck come in, you meet the driver. Yeah. And give me your name, phone number, what's your trip number. Yeah. All right, you're supposed to have... 60 pallets in this in this truck. Yeah. We're going to load you up. We scan them out. And then we load them up. Yeah. And then while we do that, we send them to the front. They can get like a little temporary bag so they can chill and yeah. eat and stuff like that. Then they come back. Every now, every now and then they come back like every 20 minutes because if yeah. we get it done early, they can leave early. Yeah. But they can't leave until like 10 minutes before they expected departure time. Yeah. So if somebody's supposed to leave at 10, and we get done feeling it at nine twenty. They just gotta wait to nine oh, fifty. So the earliest yeah. they can leave is ten minutes. Yeah, it's early. ten minutes. Yeah, so it's like we done, but you gotta wait. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I mean? Because this people mail and postal service, and yeah. so it's like real, like yeah, logistical. Yeah. Like you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, but that was the outbound. Then the inbound. That's when the mail is coming in. Yeah. This is a little bit more tricky because these people got mail. You know what yeah. I mean? So we had to take it off the truck. Man, I think at like one thirty, we got this truck. Like the first four boxes was just crushed. Yeah, and mail was just all in the trail. So it's hard to see because these these boxes come with like we call them placards. Yeah, or like labels for where they supposed to go. Yeah, but if this mail just everywhere. Yeah, you don't know what. Zip code, we look at yeah. that zip codes. All right, all the eights. Over here, yeah. All the sevens over here. Five, all the fives over yeah. here. And that, when you say that, you going by the very first number? Uh, first three, first three number. Yeah. Of okay, code. okay. So seven six. You know, we seven six zero. Yeah. If I, I see say, that, yeah. no seven seven six seven seven six three. In orange is seven seven, 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 seven six three. So if yeah. I see seven I'm seven five two here. Yeah, yeah, I'm seven five two here. You are too. Yeah, I'm seven five two. Seven five two. Eight seven. Oh, okay. I'm yeah. three four. Yeah. Okay. Seven five four, <laughs> <laughs> but it's cool. So we had to like separate those, and like this was better because mm-hmm. I was telling my little trainer. I had some cool trainers though. Yeah, uh, I was like I could use my mind a little bit. So this makes the time go by faster because yeah. I'm thinking and like even when the problem come up, like this yeah. is good because I get lost in the problem. Yeah, yeah. I looked up and he was like twelve, and she's like, "You took your break." I was like, "Nah." She's like. Man, go take that yeah. off. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I wasn't trying to take my break because I was just trying to get all the hours I yeah. can while it's still going on. Yeah. Uh, but that's been cool. I like it. It's like I got a super dichotomy in my life right now. Because during the day, mm-hmm. I'm that dude. Yeah. Like, I'm the only dude for my company and blah, blah, blah. Yeah. At night, I'm just another face in the crowd. Like, yeah. I like that, though. Like, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, ain't no real responsibility on me. Yeah. If I mess up, the company don't fail. Yeah. Ain't no managers on my back. Yeah. Man, yeah. just put the mail where it's supposed yeah. to go. Yeah. And, <laughs> That's it. And, you know, just put the mail. Put the mail where it's supposed <laughs> to go, bro. Look at the number. Look at the master, master zip code and put it over yeah. there. Like, and I like that. It's yeah. a good balance. Like, yeah. If it was like high stress yeah. you know, overnight, like, yeah. man, we need you to blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Like, see, that'd be different. Did that'd time be... go by fast? Yeah, it do go by fast, bro. It's only six hours. Mm-hmm. I'm about to say it's six hours, so yeah. First two hours You go break by, that down. Yeah, it's yeah. two I'm about to say, I think my, my, my benchmark would always be getting to midnight. Yeah. yeah. throw yeah. me off just getting off at two, though. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And yeah. It's, dark and it's dark, and ain't dark. nobody ain't nobody up. You can't <laughs> yeah. really stop to at too many places to pick yeah. nothing up. You yeah. just, yeah. Yeah. Walmart ain't open no more. Yeah, exactly. I be thinking, like, before I get into work, I'm like, is there anything I need to get before I go to work? Because ain't nothing open after. The, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, even some gas stations be closed. Yeah. Like, let me get gas now. Let me get my yami. Yeah. Let me get some chips or something. Yeah. You know what I mean? And I come home and I just, yeah. Yeah. Just, but that's been my life lately. And it's it's been an adjustment period. That was this week for sure. That's yeah. been this week. But I think they give us two days off like I was off last night and I'm off today. Uh, yeah. And I go back to work uh, tomorrow. But Sunday, they did, like, it was kind of slow, like, Monday and Tuesday. Mm-hmm. And the uh, supervisor was like, if anybody want to go home, you can go home now. It won't count against you. Yeah. And I thought about it. Like, we was off then. I was like, man, yeah. I can go home. I go to sleep. But I was like, then I thought about some bills I had to pay. Yeah. Like, nah, I'm going to stay. You know what I'm yeah. saying? But when it's slow, they, they'll send people home. They'll send you up. Like, my, uh, Sunday, I got sent home at, like, 12 because everything was just done. You yeah. know what I mean? But. Which was cool to me because it's like. Yeah. So how long you been there working? Three days, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, okay. This is my first actual week, you know. What okay, I mean? but, okay. And I uh, go to work this weekend, but that's been cool to me, though. You know, it was in a different period, so it's like 
I'm really like gauging energy like yeah. throughout the day. Like, where am I? At? Am I gonna make it through the night? You know, yeah. eating. I have like I I eat like one one time a day. Yeah, this is all we got. Just been eating whatever I eat for lunch. Yeah, doing my day job. That's it. That's it. Because yeah. I come, ain't no time to go get nothing after I get off. Yeah, man. I ain't no super meal prep dude. Yeah. You know what I mean. So I just like man, I'm just thug it. Like yeah, so I just been thugging it. So yeah, it's really been cool. Like you know yeah. And that's just kind of what I've been doing, man. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. I didn't even know you was looking for that. Yeah, remember I said I was going to do that second job? I said it like three weeks ago before yeah. we started the episode. I was like, I think I'm going to pick up that second job. Yeah. And now that's it. And now that's it. But it only go for like five weeks. So yeah. I'll be done in like December or January. Just, yeah. Unless they like me. They say if they like you, they'll keep you on. Yeah. 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 And I had some people tell me, they was like, hey, man, you you a good worker, man. Yeah. Blah, blah, blah. That boy, that, ooh, that 82. I'm about to say I'm thinking about it. I'm like man I would I, I could use the money yeah but would it's I like I, I freaking I applied but I forgot to do, to go to the thing to the little job which fair. didn't make sense I was like so I gotta apply then still go to the job fair but the job fair is really just doing all your extra stuff they call it just dang there like an orientation yeah you know, on so. board and that's when you do because I for sure stuff. applied then <laughs> I forgot that weekend I was yeah. like oh, I missed my weekends <laughs> being used that way yeah <laughs> Uh, the application is kind of a little extensive because they got to do like the background because you yeah. deal with people mail, yeah. So they do a background clearance. They asked me if I wanted to get on the forklift. I ain't never. I was like, nah. That's see, that's too much. I was about to say, yeah, nah. Uh, I'm, I'm yeah, not doing I'm that. I told them nope, that. Nope. They was like, man, they're like, you sure you don't want? I'm like, nah. Yeah, I'm good. good. You forklift uh, certified though, huh? No, no. Oh, okay, me neither. Me neither. Hey, I've never done a forklift. I, I ain't never seen a forklift in person. You know, what I'm saying? and I worked all these jobs that had for some reason. I'm about to say for some reason I just. Thought she was forklift certified. Nah, so. nah. He's just that type of person. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You just, <laughs> yeah. I know I can do it. I can do many, it. Yeah, I don't. Yeah. You've lived many but lives. I like being on the ground because when you're a forklift driver, that's just like what you're gonna do. Yeah. There's no nothing else that you can do. You know yeah, what I'm saying? It's like just pick I'm like, some I'm not, up. Yeah, I'm like I'm not that kind of guy. Like, yeah. like when I was an expediter and I was talking to the little ladies that do it. Yeah, that was cool. I was giving people backstories. And yeah, what they do, blah blah blah, and talking to the truck drivers. And yeah, they like yeah. I came all the way from Minnesota. I was like damn. Yeah, that's it for your people. They're like yeah. Said, I'm gonna take this load. I gotta go to Colorado. Then I'm going back up there for Thanksgiving. Yeah, or I was up there for th- going back up there for Christmas. I was like. Yeah. All right, more power to you. And my daddy a truck driver, yeah. which is funny. So it's connecting dots for yeah. all the stuff he be talking about. But but nah, That's man. Crazy. But I say that to say this: like this week is just being like how Ed say he chooses heaven on earth. You know what I'm saying? I'm just choosing not to complain about it. Yeah, because you could be like, man. But then you just like, bro, it's only like five weeks. Yeah. I've done worse with my five weeks before. <laughs> Same. You know what I'm saying? I've been unemployed for more than five weeks. Yeah. So like. Having yeah. two jobs, why complain about that? You know what yeah. I mean? And, and uh, that just being like a, a, a clarif- clarifying moment, you mm-hmm. know, a moment of what do we call it? Clarity. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. man, just get through it. It's cool. You know, you be yeah. all right. You know, but I definitely yesterday I slept. Yeah. <laughs> when yeah. I got off of work, I just yeah. like, man, t- I said, hey, tomorrow I just dedicated to sleep. Yeah. Like, I ain't cook nothing. Yeah. I ain't do nothing. I just came home, slept. Bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But, that's kind of what uh been going on though, man, and, and and it's been cool. You know, you meet characters and stuff like that. But I would imagine at a place like that, it's, it's well, it's some yeah, it's some people in there. But yeah, <laughs> it's some people in there. You know, like my approach is even when like entering a new environment. I guess we can talk about that. Like as extroverted as I am, I come in kind of like quiet. Yeah, because I got to see. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I got to see the layout of who's who, yeah. and how things go. And then if you give me one on one, then you'll see my personality. Yeah. I'm not just about to be like, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Funny now. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm about to say, you done had a whole day of work where you done use your social bro, media too. Yes, you know? bro. They're going to definitely get a different version of yeah. you yeah. to your day job. Yeah. You like, that's what I was telling my mom. had rest and you fully energized. Yeah, that's what I told my mom. I was like, man, I'm on the phones all day anyway. Yeah. Dealing with people. When I get there, I just want to be quiet and just yeah, just do my job and do leave. Do my job and yeah. leave, bro. And you know, the time do go by fast, though. You look up, he's already like eleven. I'm like, oh well, yeah, that's three more hours. What time you got to be in the work at your day job? Uh, eight thirty. Okay, that helps. So I get off. I'm about to say two. that ain't too bad. And how far is the post uh, office? Thirty five, thirty five minutes. So you get home around like two forty five, yeah. almost yeah. three. Yeah. 
Probably yeah, going straight to sleep. Bro, I pass Ed House every time I go. I'm like, boy, I wish I was you, because that's like yeah, right shot. there. Oh, where is it? It's in it's in Irving. Like, oh it, shoot, down six thirty five. You get off on Est- uh, Estes. Estes. Yeah. Make a look. It's probably like I would be surprised if it's more than fifteen minutes from Estes. Yeah, because I pass it up every time. Uh, but uh, no, nah, it's cool. You know, I get up at two, come home. So I'll take a shower. Yeah. Take a shower. After the shower, you know, after that. Yeah, you lay down. It's, it's, a, a, it's, a, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. It's Your a body, wrap. like, okay. My, my head yeah. hit that pillow. Yeah. Gone. You know Snooze. what I'm saying? Snooze, bro. Yeah. But it's been cool. So that's that's going to be the next month. So it's just going to, we're going to see how we balance that out, you know? Yeah. You know, you might call me, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm yeah. like two hours of sleep, you know yeah. what I'm saying? But it's cool. It's cool. But. Anyways, I'm sorry. I took over that conversation. but Nah, it's all <laughs> good because now you got me thinking about getting a second I, job. I, I, I completely forgot uh, about that, man. Yeah, no, it's cool. Because like I said, I, I was wondering the song. That's like, I was like, I wonder if Ed can. I like, you yeah. yeah, you should have said My something. Bad, I, I did the application, but I forgot you're supposed to go to the thing that yeah. weekend. I'm, a I'm not used to having stuff to do on the weekend. Yeah, I'm going to talk to them, though, because I think it's one of those things that, like, you know, people yeah. come yeah, in. Yeah, but they say yeah, if they need some more people. Yeah, yeah if they, yeah. yeah. But don't, yeah. don't, but yeah, just ask that. Don't put my name out. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't gonna say your name. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know if I'm good <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, that's what I said. I was saying, I work from home. So yeah. I'm thinking oh, yeah, about, like, I, I can get but, up and, and But be they got somewhere. earlier shifts, though. They got yeah. like a three to nine. Yeah. They got a, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So. See, I want something in between. I yeah. can't, I don't want to do eight to two, but three, I can't go three to nine because I still be at work. Yeah, that's what I said. I I can do like four to, like four to two. 10, like 10, I wish they had a yeah. six to twelve. But if they had a six, that oh, yeah. would be six so to twelve. That'd yeah, be, that'll, be that'll be perfect. That'd be so perfect. Bro. That'll be perfect. So basically, oh yeah, they did kind of explain. Because I get off at four thirty, so yeah. I could I could go do yeah. a six to twelve easy. I, yeah, I think we are. I think they explained it too. We're like, like we bridge the uh, like the main worker that people that's hired on with the company. Yeah, we like cover like when that ship get off. Yeah, the next ship. Oh, so they can be running all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, okay. yeah. We, we kind of like feel so y'all, that. that. That's what y'all yeah, need to do. Yeah, okay. yeah. Okay. And they say if you, and you know, you know, they got a little class system. Yeah. Without having yeah. a class system, we got the red, red vest. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> people that's high on got the black vest. Yeah. Uh, yeah. People that, hey, the people that did it before got like a blue vest. Yeah. And he like, yeah, oh, I, I yeah. see what it is. Like, yeah, I see what all it right. is. As as they all right. see that red vest, they, okay, yeah. I, I yeah. understand why yeah. it all makes sense now. <laughs> yeah, no, hey, new meat on the yard. But you know that kind of stuff is psychological. Yeah. Because yeah. you're yeah. like, man, I want to get one of them black vests. I'm about to say, I know yeah. the people with the black vest walk yeah. around a little bit. Yeah, they, yeah. they got the little walk talkies. Chest up, head They got the walkie talkies. Yeah. I'd be like, all right. Yeah. I'd be like, yeah. all right, all right. All right. They got some buddies. They, they talk a little different. Talk a little different. Yeah. But yeah, let me know if they still. Because I guess yeah. I put my application. I just didn't go to the thing because I forgot. And you know what's funny? Dang. I I did this job my senior year mm-hmm. before I graduated. That's how I paid for that section at the club. By yeah. the way, this job. Yeah. And that's why I was so out of there. Yeah. I just had money on me. Yeah. I didn't have no responsibilities. But anyway, they do that every year around Christmas time. I don't know why I didn't think about that. We could have been doing that every yeah. year. Yeah. Just like for a month, just yeah. like bro, let's just, just go. Put your head down. Just for yeah. a month, bro. Yeah. I told I told my mom I said, bro, I could have been telling everybody, yeah. all of us, all four or five of us. I was say last, not last year, but the year before last, I definitely could have used yeah, that man for sure, yeah. for sure. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna see what they're talking about, but for sure, it's a it's you know, and it, it's definitely like Ed, being Ed was on the phone about it. It's definitely better when it's like not your only job. Yeah. You got something in the morning. I mean, during the day, that's your. What yeah. you're doing, doing this yeah. is extra, but that's why I'm not tripping on nobody. You know, if people yeah. have them egos and those kind of jobs, like, yeah. oh man, I got the black vest. So like, yeah. oh, okay, nigga, you got the black vest. Nigga. Congratulations, congratulations. But I say yeah, this, this where you gonna be. I yeah, yeah that's what I said. You know. So hey, I'm happy for you I'm that you're yeah. progressing here progressing. and ain't where I'm at. Yeah, I'm, exactly. just, I'm just, I'm only here for a good time. Yeah. I know they not think, alone. Not alone. But I know, but I know they think, I know they think I'm a like criminal or something. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like. Uh, cause you I think that thing with a hoodie on, and yeah, bro, I be, yeah, bro, cause you could, kinda, you could, you could, you could <laughs> definitely wear anything in there. Yeah, he had to love it, cause yeah, oh man, but he just explained what he yeah. worked out in. He could literally go up there in that. You know, oh, what so I'm it's saying? just you just gotta have the vest. As long on. as you got your sweats and that, that's good. Long pants, that's it, okay. and some boots that or some shoes that cover your ankles. They say. Oh, huh, okay, that's interesting. No low tops, huh? That mean they got Subu. You know what that mean they got Subu. Oh, yeah. Somebody rolled their ankle. Yeah. yeah. When they said that, because they been, they put a big emphasis on that, like, <laughs> your shoes got to cover your ankles. I said, but they came here in some bags. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Hey, hey, it's a, a buddy came in some bands yeah. and came up on him. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's all that was. That's all that was. Because I, hey, I said, I don't remember that last time. <laughs> hey, last time, man, I was just some Amexes. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? I was like, oh, they must have got sued and had to pay somebody. But no, it was cool. Uh, and it's just been like uh, balancing that is cool. And you know what? My first day there, I ain't going to lie. My first day there, man, okay, I enjoy everybody. But I, the first day I worked, I was on the sort. I was just mm-hmm. doing the manual labor, just putting the letters on the conveyor belt. And that first little uh, crew that was in there was me. It was like another two other, two other black guys, they African or whatever. But they just was not saying nothing, like not talking to me. I was like, bro, I ain't here for you to just, you ain't got to just make yeah. my day. But like, bro, I'm asking you something about the job. Like, well, tell me what I'm supposed to do with this. Like, mm-hmm. or if the, if the belt stopped, you can reset the belt. I'm like, bro. What yeah. you know what I'm saying? But what's funny is at ten, so at ten is when the next black best shift come in, mm-hmm. and I ain't gonna lie, it was a relief. I saw a bunch of little YGs came in there, bro. Mm-hmm. My co- I said my co- Ed, I'm talking Nike Techs, mm-hmm. Shiesties. Oh my gosh, bro, they didn't have Shiesties on. Oh my god, and they said we couldn't wear the Shiesties. Oh my god, I, I could have worn my Shiesty, but anyway. It was like three little YGs. I call them Y because they can't be over than like <laughs> 22. Uh-huh. Hey, if you saw it, you think like. <laughs> I got an image you when you say, say shy oh, yeah. you say I shy got a body and I beat I don't know exactly who it is. You know they ain't got no meat on their bone. They yeah, all, I was about to say, I knew that. Yeah. I thought it was skinny. Yeah, skinny. Yeah. But they Black were, forces. Bo, bo. Yeah, bo. Bunch of little YGs. That's on. They had the little black vest. Yeah. They came in. They're like, man, how, this, like, this your first day? I was like, yeah. They're like, man, this shit easy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they're like, man, this shit easy. But but they would say some cool little why I don't got none of their name. I don't want to know their name. Yeah. yeah. No, yep. no, sir. I yeah. said, yeah. I said, hey, hey. Yeah. Like, hey, hey, big, hey, don't go beyond this. Hey, yeah. hey, big dog. Hey, yeah. big dog. <laughs> hey, boy. <I> said, <laughs> hey, big dog. I don't know. He's like, man, yeah, I was over there last night, but they started fighting. I said, oh. Yeah. No, hey, no, boy. no, no. Boo, I walked the other way. Yeah. I walked the other way. I'm like, I don't want to know none of that. Where y'all be like, at? Alright, I'ma mess with you. Yeah, they shite these on. They all three of them had they shite these on. I hear. Yeah, and nah. they told us we couldn't wear those, but yeah. it's overnight. So yeah. But anyway, uh, but the one one of the guys he was like, man, he said, "This your only job or your second job?" He said, "It's my second job." He's like, "Yep." He's, he's like, yep. "You're doing the right thing," you know <laughs> what I'm saying? But them them little wazzy, they cool though. They yeah. funny to me. Yeah, because it's like. I remember that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Just like just yeah. keep a respectful distance. Just yeah, yeah. We just ain't like, doing nothing outside of work. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, no. when I leave, you better not be behind yeah. me. Yeah. Hey, I ain't it, trying to hear nothing. Hey, and I ain't it, trying to talk for too long. Hey, because it is some Hellcats in the parking lot. I'm like, yeah. Yep. I yep. Said, I'm about to say, that's where all their money go to. Yeah, I'm yep. about to say, I said, I don't know how much the people own get paid. I know yeah. that I get paid. Yeah. And I get paid kind of good. So yeah. I know if they own it, own it. Yeah. Um, I said, oh, the boy living it up. Yep, they living that I life. Said, I know they got a zone in the car. Yep. I, said, <laughs> I, said, I, hey, I said, I know they got a zone in the car for sure. They ready. Real talk. But uh, they ended up being some cool little dudes, man. I just call them the YGs. I don't know. Yeah. None of their names. Uh, I just keep it work. You yeah. Know? yeah. But yeah, yeah. I just keep it work. I you said, better. Hey, no, I yeah. better. <laughs> hey, I know better. Yeah. <laughs> Help me set this wolf trap. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, what you doing in the morning? No, home, bro. Home. I gotta go home. Yeah, yeah. Go yeah. Home. Family, yeah. family, family. One dude was like, You coming you come back tomorrow? I said, Why? <laughs> <laughs> I said, Why? I said, uh, but I said, Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But nah, man, it's cool though. It's just one of those things, though, you meet a lot of people, a lot of like. I must I imagine different, different situations. Bro, it's a lot of, got, like you said, everybody got a story. Everybody got a yeah. story, bro. Yeah. A lot of yeah. foreigners in there, not just like black, it's Hispanics. Yeah. I, mean, I saw, man, one dude looked like freaking Nav. He worked the forklift. Yeah. I said, why you came in here so dressed up? Yeah. But that's how they do, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But it's cool, though. It's going to be interesting. It's one of them jobs, like, you just stay as long as you want to. Like, yeah. when I had it back in college, I just worked it enough to get my graduation stuff paid for, and I just never went back. Yeah, I, I even I don't even tell people I used to work there. I say them people are long gone anyway. Yeah. That I was working. I'm, for. Honest, I'm, honest, I'm pretty sure they got a, a pretty high turnover rate. Yeah, so for, sure. Yeah. for sure, for yeah. sure. For sure, man. But it's 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 funny though. It's yeah. funny. It's a funny little night job. I'm sick. I forgot about that. Yeah. If I don't put nothing in my calendar, it just don't exist to me. Yeah, yeah. I was about to say, man, I, I don't even remember the conversation, but you got me thinking, because I was talking to my dad, and I think I told you uh, this yesterday, too, Ed. I was like, man, 
I really want to like learn a trade. Like I've been wanting to do something with my hands. Like I'm at the yeah. computer all day and mm-hmm. like I do like creative stuff, but I just been wanting to like just get hands on with something. Mm-hmm. But I also want a second job. Just so you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Pay off some yeah. credit card debt. Yeah. You know what I'm That's saying? Me. I'm trying to get me. another another car, so I'm just like, yeah, man, mm-hmm. let me let me find some. So I'm like, dang, yeah. I really yeah. everything that you saying, I'm like, man, let me let me go home and get on Indeed real mm-hmm. quick and mm-hmm. see what I can do. Mm-hmm. I'm going to see what they're talking about. And it, it made me think about it, too. Because, you know, they say the average person just has two jobs. You know what I mean? Yeah. I, I mean, had, these days, They right? need it. You know what I mean? And I was just like, this would be good. Like, And my mama asked me, she was like, even she said, if they try to keep you on, would you keep doing it? Mm-hmm. I said, man, now that's different. Yeah, now that's a question. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like, for a month, yeah, I can do it. Yeah, yeah like, I'm about to say, yeah, it's no when you when you yeah. it's different when you like know it got to end. Yeah, yeah, yeah you can see the end of life. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And in my mind, I'm like, man, if they ask me, yeah, which I know they're gonna ask me, because yeah. I just know I'm a good worker. They're gonna be like, well, you want to stay? Yeah, I know that's the question I gotta ask. Like, man. I don't know, maybe or man, like I, a or like a for how long do I want to stay? I probably give myself like a like a like a savings mark, like yeah. Once yeah. I get this saved up, yeah. then I leave. You yeah. know, that kind. Of, that's how you got to do that. Give yourself yeah. an end date, like is. Yeah, that's that's pretty much yeah. like whatever I would because I'm I'm definitely going home and hopping on Indeed. Just see like what part time I'm. Maybe like a, say, a eight to twelve, to six to twelve. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And let just me do know something. if you find something. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, I will. I'll drop it in a group message because yeah. yeah, I want to find something, save up some money, really just pay a lot of stuff off. Once I pay like credit card it's off, really I credit, might try. Yeah. To, I really might try to like pay off my car, depending on you know what the job is, how much I get paid, and stuff like that. But mm-hmm. just try to pay off a lot of debt. Mm-hmm. If I can do that, and then by the time summertime come. See where I'm at with it, then yeah, it'll mm-hmm. that'll that'll be different. That'll that'll work. That'll be good. Yeah, that'll man. be good. Work through the winter. And that's what I was saying on a couple episodes back. How like remember how like when I didn't have a job, a lot of stuff got behind. And yeah, I had to kind of get back. Uh, yeah, back right. Yeah. This helped me get back on schedule. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, so it came at the right time. Yeah. But when I was looking on ED before this, I mean, I feel so messed up, bro. Because I was like, dang. I said, I don't know why I ain't been bringing this up every, like, because yeah. it happens every Christmas year. Yeah. I said, damn, we could have been doing that. But um, I saw a lot of stuff on ND too. I saw a lot of, like, they had, like, a little exclusive place up there that they needed drivers. I was just like, I yeah. don't want to, that's too much. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I don't want to be with two, yeah. with the rich folk because they yeah. want too much. And, like, yeah. you ain't like to play with me. You know what yeah. I'm saying? But it, uh, this is good. I'm yeah. going gonna, I'm to I'm check it out. I'm going to talk to I'm kind of, like, slowly. You know how it is. You slowly just start meeting people, meeting people seeing like, what people do, well, and you, you know do? who to talk to. Yeah. Well, you, oh, that's the supervisor. Yeah. How long? You know. Yeah. Like one of the supervisors is supposed to be like the main supervisor. Me and her didn't already chopped it up. Yeah. You know, just like, but you know what's funny? In a job or in an organization or in a anything. Yeah. The person that the, all the workers or members complain about, yeah, I always yeah. end up being good with them. Yeah. Cause, Cause just, they don't really be mean. They just you know they want you to do your job. You know what it is? Cause, yeah. Cause I just take instruction. Yeah. Mm. They really be like people problem. I'm yeah. like, oh, just take instruction, bro. Yeah. Like it be the authority. Yeah. And yeah. I usually like talk to them like a regular person. Not yeah. like I'm scared of them. I'm scared of being fired or yeah. something like that. Like that always happens to me. I I don't know if that happened to y'all, but like yeah, whoever that person they're like, man, watch out for him or yeah. watch out for her. That usually be the person I end up getting cool. Yeah. With, you know? And it's just like that here, so. Yeah. But anyways, uh, what's going on y'all, man? I'm sorry. I, t- I took up all the time talking about that, man. I'm about to say, I don't have nothing going on. I gave all my stuff. Yeah. <laughs> but I say, yeah. No, yeah, man. But I just. I say this, man. I Like you said, man, it's been good to, like, do something different and kind of, like, I, I mean, I'm more, like, in the trades industry now. Mm-hmm. Like, I deal with them more often. Like, I was. I was at the house today with like a carpet cleaning guy. Yeah, I thought he was white. He ended up being black. Yeah, which was a relief. Yeah, they know I got a podcast, but yeah, <laughs> my job do know I got. A, I don't think anybody listens. They just always just mention it, but they yeah. never listen. But anyway, um, he ended up being a cool guy. He's telling me how like he started with a company and how he like worked there for like twenty years and he got oh, there. But his wife brought it up to him like, you know, it's up. Never mind. 
Yep. I ain't trying to be that guy, but you know. Yeah. He was like, uh, he said his wife was like, man, you building up that company, you can make your own company. Yeah. yeah. And he said three years ago is when he quit. Yeah. And he started making, he said he had, he had like a 95% customer rating for like 25 years. Yeah. I said, damn. Yeah. He cleaned the heck out them carpets. Yeah. yeah. I said, man, I said, that's crazy to sustain 95, yeah. 25 years. Yeah. I ain't the math guy y'all is, but yeah. that's crazy. You know, yeah. that's crazy numbers, that's, bro. I was about to say, that's a, that's a crazy average. Yeah, that's a crazy yeah. average. It's a guy You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But uh, it just let me, it reminded me like, man, if you got something under your belt that you can do. Man, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yo, it's limitless, you know? Yeah. Limitless, man. But, yeah, so that's kind of what I've been on, Enterprise and, and yeah. all that good stuff. And it's been good, man. But these last two off days have been good. I haven't had time to chill and relax. But man. I know that make you appreciate your man, off time a little bit more. It do, mm-hmm. man. Because you don't get as much of it. It do, man. And it's good because... You know what's funny? This is one of them things that make me act right. And you know, I'm a, I'm a brother that got to be made to act right. Yeah. Because yeah. I ain't as disciplined as, as y'all too, you know. So I'll get drunk on a Wednesday. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Easily. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? E- Easily. Now. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But, <laughs> but something like that, like, I can't do that. I got to go to work. Yeah. How about I say, keep you on. Keep and, then you at home, and then you at work. So you yeah. can't yeah. spend money when you're at work. Can't spend money. You know yep. what I'm saying? Like, we get paid Friday, but I work Friday. You know? yeah. I'm like, Yep, man. I ain't got nowhere to go with that. I was about to say, I, I can't go give me a drink. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? I got to <laughs> wait till next to work. Week. Yep. But you know what? It brought me back, like Ed said, make you appreciate it more. So yeah. when I do have a drink, like I deserve this. Yeah. When we said, we said, when I, was, uh, I got, I want to earn that beer. I think yeah. we said that one time. Yep. I want to earn that beer. Like, you know you work hard. Right? Yeah, yeah, that's when you know, that's when you, you sip and you're like, I deserve yeah. it. <laughs> that's when you sip that mug like, <sighs> <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yep. yeah, lean so. back. So it's it's been a lot of that, man. A lot of that, but um, nah, man. Um, we the nylon boys today. We are. Oh uh, yeah, man. I saw y'all. I just pulled this. I, this is my first time wearing this. I was about to say you walked out with that. I was like, I ain't seen I'd that. I'd be That's thinking I know nice. your closet. So I was like, oh, I ain't never seen that one before. Yeah, I ain't That's never nice. seen that. That's nice. I heard them. <laughs> but yeah, man, no, I like that. Nah, man. I got this from the um, Swap Me. Swap mm-hmm. Me. Swap Same. Me. This like you know what's funny. I caught this like. You know what's funny? I caught this on like the walkout. Like we was hmm. like done leaving. Yeah, and I saw this mug, and I was like, "Ooh, yeah." And that's I was the just one. Like, yeah, yeah, this yeah. the one. And I'm fitting it now, so I and I'm getting my steps in mm-hmm. at, that, at that, the job. Boy, yeah. I didn't drop like eight, so I five pounds. Yeah, like you said, I can't drink, can't. I'm yeah. not eating, so you know. Yeah, I said the job got physical component. Too. Yeah, yeah. Yep. So I was like, "Dang, I can fit this." Burning mug. them little calories. Man, it's gonna show. Yeah. And I said, "Hey, that male, hey." Yeah. At what point I got into a little? Yeah, I was about to say people don't understand, bro. I like Paper little. is heavy. Bro, like, yes, bro. Like heavy, heavy. Yes. Yeah. I was like, hook. I, yeah. I had to <laughs> lift with your legs. I had to, yeah. Yeah, I had to get under there. Uh, but no, it's cool, man. But oh, let me find a song before we not, before we get out of here. But anything coming up for you guys? Holiday season? Anything? Uh, huh? Just the regular holidays. Ain't nobody we'll going be nowhere. Orange this time. Nowhere for the holiday. I mean, no concerts, no going in. home. Oh, uh, no. Nah, I'm, I'm trying to save money. The most thing that I'm trying to do right now is buy a truck. Mm-hmm. And that's pretty much it. Buying car, like the car buying process is like exciting for me, especially like when it's something I haven't had before. Mm-hmm. So, like with this uh, trying to buy a truck, I've just been doing a lot of research on trucks because, you know, people stand on business about their trucks. So, just doing some research on like, the different companies and and what trucks have what problems and what mm-hmm. years got what and just looking at some and I've been kind of like getting I don't know man my soul been like telling me something lately so I just been kind of like drawn to like my country my country roots, roots you yeah. know what I'm saying I like I'm about to go buy me some boots and a hat and uh I bought some pants the other day I was like man these will look good with some boots and I was like that's I, the first time I've ever said that in my life. I need a boot. I need a boot. It's the first time I've ever said uh, yeah, that. Yeah, I need a new boot. Yeah, so I was just like, man, let me like, let me like really get, like lean into this. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, I've been wanting a truck for a long time. I think we talked about that before, but yeah, uh, we did. Yeah, yeah, so like just getting a truck, man. You know, just you know, give me some nice all terrain tires mm-hmm. on that thing mm-hmm. and and lift it up a little bit. You yeah. know, just yeah. I just been wanting to lean into it, work with my hands, like. 
I've just been trying to like really like just lean into your divine masculine energy. Yeah, <laughs> man. Yeah, man. Just I just been feeling it, man. I don't know. I honestly don't know what it is, but I, I know that I just been wanting to do something creative or just something with my hands. Like I've been thinking about like going back to school to get my barber's license. Come on now. Like, I literally like all hey. I, I've been like watching like videos of people cutting hair. I'm just like, man, I miss it a yeah. little bit. Man, Cause you put what the they charge these days. Too, oh, man, goodness. I'm talking hey. about it's fifty dollars an hour. I'm about like, to say I need that. I need you to get your life. Yeah. Like, I need you to get your life. Cause I just be doing myself. Yeah. I ain't about to do that. I'm, yeah, man, that's you know? uh, that's something that I like. I just been thinking about. I just been wanting to do something with my hands, man. I just been on a computer all day, and I work from home. So it's like now I just been like, man, I need to get out. Like I need to get outside. I need to like do something. Mm-hmm. You know, one hundred and forty thousand is is middle class now. That's what I read. So I, I was just to, like, I need, well, I need to get that. Yeah, I'm just. It's a lot, man. But yeah, that's it. That's that's all I got going. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Cool. Man, this has been episode one twenty nine of the Transferable Experience Podcast. Like always, remember to do all the things on all the things and. Mm-hmm. Drink your hot chocolate outside. Mm. Drink it outside. It'd be a vibe. Please use milk instead of water. <laughs> I like eggnog. I hadn't had a good eggnog. Do I'm you not just a, I'm not do you? Is the bar on the ground and you can just go buy a random one, or is it a particular brand? Buy a uh, Southern Comfort, unless you lactose intolerant, then buy the one that's like lactate, I think, and is lactose free. Yeah, I was I was at Trader Joe's and they had one, and I was like. I've never had a good eggnog, but if I just had to blindly buy one, maybe them, but I still didn't get it. Cause. Yeah, nah, get the uh, Southern Comfort. It's really, unless you like, it's you got something with texture, because it's like really thick. Mm-hmm. Like pause. thick with two C's. Yeah, pause. But um, yeah, I like the Southern Comfort kind. And then, you I know. think I want something that got more of a eggy like a creamy taste to it rather Pause. than yeah. like is because i had somewhere it's like the liquor be too much like the, oh you said the liquor it'd be an overwhelming flavor i want the overall taste to be more so like i'm drinking like something like a sweet des- mm-hmm. dessert drink uh, that just happened to have alcohol not something that's like no nah, i'm really like present. put alcohol in my i just get like the regular kind from Oh, then yeah. you spike it yourself. Okay, that yeah. might be what I need to do because I be getting the ones. Oh, you get the pre mix. So. Okay, okay, yeah. So That's I was different. like, That's when different. you say, I was like, oh nah, but yeah, nah. It get dep- the eggnog, depend- then spike, and then yeah, spike just throw it, it in a pot, heat it up, throw some, you know, a couple of shots in that thing, stir it around, heat it up, and then oh, I didn't. Good. Are you supposed to have eggnog hot? You don't have to, but yeah. Huh. Damn, when I true. whenever I put I whenever I put like liquor in it, I like warm it up because it you just gonna put in it like a whiskey. You can put whiskey in it. it you what can really you put, put in it. Oh, what I put in it, I typically put like a whiskey in it or a rum. Yeah, whiskey or rum is what yeah. I use. Rum, rum is like a, a staple. Like you put rum in any like holiday drink. You put rum in it, but I like. So yeah, I, I had to just taste somebody who know how to make. Mm. Yeah, because I'd be lost. Yeah, but yeah, man, rum or whiskey, man. I love me some eggnog. I don't really do the hot chocolate. Mm -hmm. But yeah, this has been episode one twenty (laughs) nine (laughs) again. Remember to do all the things on all the things, and we'll be back next week.